Galt is a remarkable place in a lot of ways. And the very long period of time that people kept coming back there is one indication of that. And we think we have excavated something less than 3% of the archeological volume of that site. And we have over two and a half million artifacts. We've got 150,000 more or less artifacts stratigraphically beneath Clovis with luminescence dating back to close to 16,000 years. And we're getting these small little stemmed points. And that time slot where you would find those kinds of things is way up here. And you've got Paleo Indian, and then you've got Clovis, and then you've got a stratigraphic break with almost nothing in it. And then here's this view, what we're calling the Galt Assemblage. We have a very strong case for an older than Clovis component. And there's nothing in between. There's nothing in the late Paleo Indian or the Clovis or that sterile zone to indicate stuff's moving down through the stratigraphic section. And so we have multiple sets of uh, technologies. And the two that we're most interested in from Galt are Clovis, with its by now rather well-known array of uh, Clovis blades, Clovis bifaces, Clovis projectile points, scrapers, knives, so forth and so on. When we look at the Galt assemblage, we do not see the elaborate sophistication of the production of things like Clovis points, but we do have projectile points. They probably function perfectly well for those people. They're just not very uh, artistically impressive or, or technologically impressive. They were making blades that are quite similar to Clovis blades, but uh, doing it in a little bit different way. They were accomplishing the same thing in their way. Those are the sorts of behavioral details that we'd like to be able to identify, extract, consider, and, and try to look at in the big picture. What we can say right now is that in all probability, there never was, before Clovis, never was a widespread horizon of a shared technology. You had these distinctive pods around over the landscape and they were the hosts, plural, across which Clovis technology spread. The peopling of the Americas has been a very long process and it has as many pieces to it as the biggest, baddest uh, jigsaw puzzle you ever saw.